Aloha and welcome to Upside Down Dance and Pilates Level 1 Chair. With us today are Malia, Nicole, and Lani. Let's go ahead and start with some footwork. Our springs are going to be one on one and one on three. We'll start with our heels on and our arms down, reaching out through the fingertips. Good. Nice deep inhale tall and exhale. Go ahead and press it down. And inhale, come on up. And again, exhale two and inhale up. Exhale three and inhale up. Exhale four and inhale up. And a five, bring it up. And a six, bring it up. And a seven, bring it up. Last time, and eight. Very good, change to arches. So put the center of your arch on, try and wrap your toes and your heels around. Make sure your tush is at the very front edge of your chair, and we are trying to be in neutral the best we can. Deep inhale, and exhale, press it down one. Lift it up, and a two. Lift it up, and a three. Lift it up, and a four. Lift Lift it up, squeezing the glutes and hamstrings on the way down. Lift it up, and a six. Good, two more please, and a seven, and lift, and eight. Excellent, balls of the feet on, high stiletto heels. Make sure your pinky toe and your big toe are down, and your heels are as high as you can go. Deep inhale in your neutral, exhale, press it down, one. Lift it up and two, lift it up, and a three, lift it up, and a four, lift it up, and a five, lift it up, and a six, lift it up, and a seven. One more time please, and stay right there. Put your hands on your knees. Let's go, flex your feet without moving your thighs, and press the toes down, one, Inhale, lift, and a two. Inhale, lift, and a three. Inhale, lift, big breath out, four. And lift, and five. And lift, and six. And lift, two more, seven. And lift, one more, eight. And lift, very, very good. Okay, right heel is gonna go on. You're gonna reach your left leg straight out in front of you. Sitting as tall as you can, arms are still down. Point your left toe, deep inhale, exhale. Press that right heel down and lift it up. And two, lift it up. And three, lift it up. And four, lift it up. And five, Lift it up, and six, lift it up, and seven, lift it up. One more time, ladies. Eight, very good, change. Left heel is on. Shift your tush a little more forward in case it started to slide back so that you're right on top of your sits bones. Reach that right leg out in front of you, point that toe, shoulders are down, energy is up, deep breath, and press it down. Exhale, one, and lift and a two, and lift, looking great. Three, and lift, and four, and lift, and five, bring it up, and six, bring it up, and seven, bring it up, one more time, eight, and up, nice work. All right, let's go ahead and move into ankle exercise. So you're gonna come on up, turn around, Bring the right ball of your foot onto the carriage, you, the pedal. You can either put your hands in a little triangle at your knee, or you can just bring your hands to the sides of the chair, whichever is more comfortable for you. So we're just moving at the ankle. We're not really allowing the knee to slide up and down at all. Deep inhale, nice neutral spine, and exhale. Press through that left foot, and bring it up. Again, two. You can also think about the standing leg. Three, is it supporting you in a nice neutral spine? Four, 
Think of your shoulders and your neck, keeping them down. Five, we'll go for eight, six, and up, smiling. Seven, and up. One more, please. Eight. Very nice, let's go ahead, change legs. Left foot comes on, knee goes on, stabilizing the shoulders, pulling the navel into the spine. Deep inhale and press it down. Exhale, one, and lift, and a two, and lift, and a three, and lift, and a four, and lift, and a five, and lift, and six, and lift, and seven, and lift. Last one, eight. Very good. All right, let's come off from it and move into our hamstrings. So we're gonna go one on three, taking the bottom spring off. Good, flipping onto your back and bringing your heels right onto the pedal. Remember, you don't wanna be too close to the pedal or else you won't get the hip extension that we're going for. All right, feet are sits bone distance apart. Neutral pelvis the best you can. Inhale, exhale, scoop through the abs and press the pedal down, almost touching the wood. And then inhale, control it up, keeping the ribs connecting. And again, exhale, bring it down to and pull it up. And bring it down three and up. Again, exhaling four. Good, feeling your neutral pelvis the whole time. Five, and up, and six, and up. Two more ladies, seven, and bring it up. And one more, eight. Very good. All right, onto your side. We'll roll onto our left side using our right leg first. Let's, yes. Drop it down to one spring. And remember, you want to adjust yourself so that you're in one long line. The heel, the knee, the hip, the ribs and the shoulders. And then the bottom leg is going to be pulled up at a 90 degree angle. Get your waist lifted from underneath so you have that support and feel the length out the crown of your head. Deep breath and exhale, press that pedal down. And control it up. And again. Squeeze those inner thighs, two, and bring it up. Again, big exhale, three, and lift it up. Big exhale, four, and lift it up. Big exhale, five, and lift it up. Three more, check your waist, six, lift it up. Check those shoulders, seven, lift it up. One more. Eight. Good. Carefully bring your pedal up to rest. And then you're going to flip right over to the other side. Yep. Start with the pedal down about hip height. Remember you want your heel, your knee, your hip, your ribs, and your shoulders in one long line. We want our waist lifted and you want that right knee up in front of you. Deep inhale. Exhale. Press the heel down. And lift it up. Again, exhale two, lift it up. Exhale three, lift it up. Exhale four, lift it up. Exhale five, lift it up. Three more. Good, two more, seven, and give it a lift. Last one, eight. Excellent, carefully come on up and bring that pedal to rest. All right, let's move into some arm work. So you're going to have one on one and we're gonna turn around and press the pedal down and then turn back away from your pedal and have both hands on. I like to start with both elbows straight. If your chest is really tight, you will need to have your elbows bent a little bit. Sitting right up on your sits bones, inhale. Bend the elbows up. And now as you exhale, press down. Make sure you get those triceps working. Again, inhale, bend it up. And exhale, press it down. Trying to keep the ribs as connected as possible. Inhale, bring it up. 
and exhale, this is three. Inhale, bring it up, and exhale, press down four. Inhale, bring it up, and exhale, press down five. Inhale, bring it up, and exhale, press down six. Inhale, bring it up, and exhale, press down seven. One more, please. Bend it up, and press down. Good, turn side, and carefully bring that pedal up to a bit of a rest. Good, we're gonna go into one arm push quadruped. So go ahead and flip your mat. And we'll leave one on one. And we'll start with the pedal down on all fours. Very good. All right, inhale, bend that right elbow up, keeping both shoulders as square as possible, and then press it down. Oh, one and bend it up, press it down two, bring it up, and a three, bring it up, and a four, bring it up, stabilizing with that left arm, five, three more, six, and up, and a seven, and up, last time, eight. Good, bring your pedal up to rest, and let's turn to the other side, please. Pressing down, stabilizing with the right side, squaring both shoulders off so your left elbow will start with a bit of a bend in it. Here we go, bend that left elbow, inhale, and exhale, press that pedal down one. Bring it up, press it down two. Bring it up, and a three. Bring it up, and a four. Bring it up, and a five. Bring Bring it up, exhale, seven, bring it up, last time, eight, very good, all right, go ahead, bring your pedal to rest, flip your mat back around, and we'll go right into spine stretch forward. Let's flip our spring up to two, so one heavy on two, good. Feet are straddled, you're trying to sit in as much neutral spine as possible. Nod your chin, and now exhale, fold it forward. And inhale, draw back up. And again, exhale, fold it forward. And inhale, draw back up. And exhale, this is three. And inhale, draw it up. And exhale, this is four. And inhale, draw it up. And exhale, this is five. And inhale, draw it up. Three more. Six. And inhale, get as tall as you can. Exhale, this is seven. And inhale, tall as you can. Last one, this is eight. And inhale, nice and tall. Very good. Okay, one on three, one on one. We're gonna flip around and do some scapula isolations, elevation and depression, and then move right into our toe taps. So flip around, make sure your head is not on the wood. You're gonna grab onto your pedals, palms face down, and legs are together. Find a nice um, neutral to start. Here we go, inhale, shrug the shoulders up by the ears, get a stretch in your lats, and now exhale, glide the shoulders down to the hips. And again, inhale, shrug the shoulders up. And exhale, glide the shoulders down. And inhale, shrug the shoulders up. And exhale, glide the shoulders down. One more set, gals. Inhale, shrug it up. And exhale, glide it down. Go into a nice deep imprint, keeping the shoulders down. Bring that right leg up to tabletop. And now bring the left leg up to meet it. Here we go, dip the right toe down, keep the shoulders connected. And exhale, bring it up. One, left toe, inhale. And exhale, bring it up. Right toe, inhale. And exhale, bring it up. Left toe, inhale. And exhale, one more time. Right toe, inhale. And exhale up. Left toe, inhale. And exhale up. Good, carefully put the feet down. Go ahead and let the pedal rest and come on up to seated. All right, let's move into our hundreds. Hop on up, 
you're gonna lie on to your chair. So you wanna come all the way to the very edge of the chair and roll to your lower back and bring your legs up at tabletop. Excellent, reach those arms out and we'll keep our knees bent today. Inhale, oh, one, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, 10. Inhale, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, 20. Inhale, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, 30. Inhale, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, 40. Inhale, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, 50. Inhale, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, 60. Inhale, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, 70. Inhale, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, 80. Inhale, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, 90. Inhale, two, three, four, five, and exhale, two, three, four, 100. Excellent. Come on up and let's go into cat standing front. We'll do first with spinal articulation. All right, here we go. Nice and tall. Nod your chin and roll down. Good. Inhale, extend your spine tail to head. Feel free to bend your knees a little bit if you need to. Exhale, curl the pelvis under and roll up, gliding the shoulders down and standing nice and tall. Again, inhale, nod the chin and roll down. Now as you extend your spine, try not to move the pedal and see how much fun that is. Inhale and then exhale, curl the pelvis under and roll yourself up. Beautiful, adding the pulses. Nod the chin, and you're gonna roll down all the way. Now come up a little bit, inhale, and go down a little bit more, a little bit more, and come up halfway, inhale. Again, down, 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 and come up, inhale, exhale, down, down, down. Come up, and all the way, gliding the shoulders down, pulling the belly button, Last one of those, nod the chin, and let's roll down through the spine, bringing the pedal down, squeezing the glutes and hamstrings to help anchor the pelvis. Come up halfway, inhale, and exhale. Down, down, down. Inhale to lift, again. Down, down, down. Inhale to lift, and down, down, down. Come up halfway, and then exhale, roll all the way up. Good. Washer woman will do 10 pulses. Nod the chin and scoop and roll down. Keeping the shoulders stable, bend the elbows. Inhale and exhale. One and a two and a three and a four and a five and a six and seven and eight and nine and 10. Come all the way up to standing. Good, very nice. All right, let's come around back and do torso press seated. Go ahead and change your springs to three and then take the other one off. You're gonna start seated as, to the very back edge of the chair as you can go. Reach the hands, palms stays back, nice and tall. Deep breath, exhale, scoop from the belly and roll back. Good, inhale. And now exhale, you're gonna round forward, hollowing the low belly backwards more in a big C. And then you're gonna roll up nice and tall. Again, exhale. Glutes and hamstrings squeeze as your abdominals pull in. Very nice. Inhale, stay. Exhale, round forward, initiating from the belly, stabilizing through the glutes and hamstrings. And come on up. Let's do two more. Exhale, scoop and curl it under. You may feel a stretch in the front of the thighs. Inhale, stay. Exhale, hollow the abs, round it forward. And roll up, nice, one more time. And scoop the pelvis and roll it under. Inhale, stay once you get there. And exhale, round back forward. And roll up. All right, let's move into scapula isolations, prone. So we're going to leave the springs one on three. You're gonna bring your pelvis onto the uh, seat. Bring your legs together tight for the first set and hover the pedal up over the wood here. All right, here we go. Pinch your shoulder blades together, keeping the ribs connected, and then press the shoulders forward. One, and inhale, bring it together. 
Exhale, two. Inhale, bring them together. Exhale, three. Inhale, bring them together. And exhale, four. Go into a neutral shoulder girdle alignment. Keep the ribs connected. And let's just bend the elbows. Inhale, bend. And exhale, straighten. One. Lengthen the legs. And two. Bend. And three. And bend. And a four. Very good. Let's go ahead and use our right hand. Bring your left hand at your forehead. And now we'll just do one arm at a time. Bend that right elbow and press it down one. A little bit of a challenge here. Press it down two. And bend. Press it down three. And bend. Press it down four. Change. Here we go. Bend that left elbow and press it down one. Double check your belly, make sure it's working for you. Two, and bend, and three, and bend, and four. Very nice, go ahead, come on up. And we're going to come off the front now and do swan from the floor. So again, we'll do elevation and depression of the scapula before we go into our full extension. So you're down, your legs are separated, and the pedal is all the way up at rest to start. So there shouldn't be really any tension on the springs right now, if you can. If you have really tight shoulders, you may need to pull the bar down a little bit. Okay. Let's shrug the shoulders up by the ears and pull the shoulders down. Keep the belly lifted. And again, shrug up, elevate, exhale, depress, pull it down. Two more. Inhale, shrug up, and exhale, pull it down. One more. Shrug it up, and exhale, Pull it down, keep it down. Glide the shoulders down more, reach out and come up to full extension. Arms are straight. Inhale, stay, and exhale, fold back forward. Again, inhale, exhale, scoop the shoulders down, squeeze the bum, pull the abs in, come to full extension, deep breath, and go back down. Two more, please, you look fabulous. Deep breath, shoulders down, reach out, come up into full extension. Inhale, stay. And go back down. Last time, ladies, deep breath. And exhale, come on up into full extension. Deep breath. And bring it on down. Very nice. Bring the pedal to rest. Go back into a nice child's pose. Allow yourself to breathe in across your back, letting the lower back release in case you brought any tension to it. All right, let's move into some sideline exercises. Hop up. These springs can be left on three, or you can add one up to four if you need to for a little extra support. Go ahead and bring the pedal all the way down to the wood and reach the left arm up towards the ceiling, navel to the spine, energy out through the legs. Deep breath, exhale, scoop and hover up for just a moment, and then go back down and put it on the wood. And again, exhale, hover up, two, and go back down. And exhale, hover up, three, and go back down. One more, exhale, hover up, four, and now you're gonna go back down. Keeping the pedal all the way down, lift your left leg side, and flex and lower, and point and lift, two, flex and lower, point and lift, three, flex and lower, point and lift, four, flex and lower, two more, point and lift, five, flex and lower, and point and lift, six, Flex and lower. Very good. Come on up, bring the pedal to rest, and let's hop on over to the other side. Press the pedal down. Line yourself up the best you can in one long line. Reach the opposite arm up towards the ceiling. Deep breath. Exhale, scoop from the underneath rib and pull it up. And bring it back down. Again, pull it up two and bring it down. And pull it up three, and bring it down. And pull it up four. Good, bring it down, pressing into the wood. Lift the right leg, point and lift, flex and lower one. Point and lift, flex and lower two. Point and lift, flex and lower three. Point and lift, flex and lower four. Point and lift, flex and lower five, one more, point and lift, flex and lower six. Excellent, come on up. Let's turn back around to the other side and go into mermaid sitting. You can
can have the springs on three or four, whichever is more comfortable for you. And go ahead, have a seat. Good. Bring your left arm up towards the ceiling. And now go ahead and you're gonna start slide bending. Find the pedal and push the pedal down just a little bit. Good, start to come back up, gliding the shoulders down and bring that left arm down. Perfect, and let's do it again. Lift the left arm and side bend. Find the pedal and then you can push the pedal down a little bit, but not so far that you tip off. Start to come on up and bring it down. Just one more, lift the arm and slide down side and start to come on up and bring that arm down. Nice, let's flip to the other side, please. Very good, lift that right arm up and now side bend and press that pedal down. Good, start to come on up and bring the arm down. And again, inhale to lift and exhale to side bend and inhale to lift and exhale to lower. And one more. Inhale to lift. And exhale to side bend. And inhale to lift. And exhale to lower. Very nice. All right, let's finish up with some stretching. Go ahead, come on up. And we're going to pick up your right leg and put it right on top of the chair. And you're going to lunge forward. You can hold onto the chair for support. Keep lifting in your navel, keep reaching out through the back heel, and you're trying to get a stretch through the front of the left hip here. Again, you're trying to keep your hips as square as you can. Make sure your shoulders are down, your head is supported. Good. And when you're ready, go ahead, straighten out that right leg, adjust your foot a little bit, and then you can go forward, rounding nose towards the knee, or you can keep neutral pelvis and have a nice flat spine, whatever feels good for you today. And just breathe gently, making sure you have support from your standing leg. Good, and let's go into our piriformis stretch. You're gonna turn that leg out. Go ahead, lunge yourself forward, and if you need to, slide that bottom leg backwards and get a nice big stretch in the back of that right hip and the front of the left hip. And you can go all the way down towards the chair if you like. Good. And come up out of it and let's go ahead, change legs. Bring the left leg up into a nice lunge. Breathing, opening the front of that hip, gliding the shoulders down, using the chair for support if you need it. Good. Good, let's go ahead when you're ready. Straighten out that leg. Go forward, you either can keep a neutral spine or you can go all the way forward and round. Bend that bottom leg, turn it out, and drop down. You can slide the back leg out and get more stretch in the front of the right hip and the back of the left hip. Good, and when you're ready, slide on down towards the chair. on the chair, reach out, you can separate your legs a little bit and go into a nice neutral spine the best you can and get a stretch through the arms and possibly the backs of the hamstrings. And just breathe into the arms, opening them out. And then when you're ready, go ahead and bend the elbows. You're going to put the palms of your hands together need to bend your knees a little bit, do so, and this will increase the stretch in your shoulders. Good. And release out of it and come on up. Very wonderful work today, ladies. 